started selling when I was nine in the uh, Opti uh, at Murray's Bay Sailing Club, which is in Auckland, near really close to where I grew up. Uh, yeah, I definitely got into sailing due to my parents' interest in sailing. Both my parents were and are sailors. Yeah, I got into sailing when um, I was nine years old down in Taranga at uh, Coolum Park. Um, had a little blue wooden Optimus called Peanut, uh, which was in the family from my grandfather back uh, 20, 30 years. So I remember it was quite funny. Um, I think Peter Burling's dad, Richard, was um, our sailing director at the time. So learned a lot from, from Pete and his dad and really enjoyed it. I think one of the excite most exciting things about sailing and, um, is that we get to travel a lot over over our campaign and we get to see a lot of new places and um, I think that in a lot of other jobs we wouldn't get this opportunity and uh, we're pretty thankful for being able, to, being able to represent New Zealand and so many different cool places over the world. My favourite thing about Zyke Gear is the comfort. I find it really easy and nothing irritates me and so you can just go out in the water and not have to think about that and just focus on the racing. Yeah, I think um, also the, the big range that Zyke offers. Um, when you're going online and you're buying your gear, you know you're going to be well kitted out for all conditions and I think that makes it pretty comfortable on the water and, and you can just focus, like Jimmy said, on the racing. Last summer we were training and it was like 25 knots flat water, which is our max speed conditions. Uh, and then I had made a mistake and pulled the board rack on way too much for those conditions and we were just so loose like there's a, I feel like there's a nacre fast that people feel that is probably not fast in terms of knots but with how out of control it is it feels very fast. Emma likes to play these little games on me where she pulls more <laughs> rake instead of less and then poor old me's right at the front of the boat trying to get the boat to come down and it doesn't always come down. Yeah. Yeah, we just uh, ended up going way too high and then stopped very fast and both flew very far. <laughs> yeah, Jason and I are very prone to having things go wrong. Uh, when you're travelling a lot, it's quite easy for that to happen. But um, yeah, we're a special case for sure. Uh, one of the times was I left my bag in France when we arrived in Italy and yeah I realised that it had my laptop, passport, wallet, everything vital really um, and yeah we tried to get it sent but it never showed up so we were driving through Switzerland trying to find the embassy so I could actually get home. Yeah and I think uh, I remember even just as far back as last year uh, things haven't improved we managed to leave a spinnaker <laughs> pole and trampoline behind in Parma so that was pretty exciting. <laughs> the ultimate sailing goal for anyone's the triple crown isn't it? <laughs> Speak for yourself I think but Olympic goal would be a great start and that would be definitely our goal for the immediate future.